Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing very well today. I am so excited. I literally was not planning on filming today, but I was like, I know what's coming in the mail today and I have to film. <laughs> and the reason that I wanted to film today was because I got my Odin's Eye mystery box in the mail. I'm so, so excited. I purchased this I think it was like a few weeks ago or a couple weeks ago at this point. So I am seriously so excited to see what is in this box. I did pick up the larger sized box. They had two options, one that was like $40 and then one that was $75 or $80. I don't even remember at this point, but this is how big it is. That's not really that big. So they better have some good stuff in here or I'm gonna be upset. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's see what's in this box. Again, I have no idea what's coming in here. This is completely first impressions. This is seriously like you are opening this box with me. So let's get started. I'm so, so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay, so of course, it's all nicely wrapped in here. I always love to see it. Okay, let's go. I'm already, I'm already so excited. I'm sorry if I'm moving the camera so much. Um, okay. So let's start with this. It looks like a little pink, like pamphlet of something. I know that Odin's Eye sells jewelry. Oh, that is gorgeous. I know that they sell jewelry, so let's take a look. What is this? Wow, this looks really pretty. For some reason, when I thought they sold jewelry, I thought it would be kind of like cheapy looking, but this is actually really pretty. Here is what it looks like. It's this really beautiful heart piece here. Wow, that is really pretty. I'm putting this on right now. I have such a big neck, so I don't love uh, and it's feeling a little bit suffocated. So I don't love that, to be honest, but it is really gorgeous. Um, so yeah, anyways, there's that. We have another jewelry piece, it looks like here. Same really cute pink pat like pamphlet or thing to hold the stuff. Okay, I don't know how I feel about this. This just kind of looks cheapy, but let's see. I think it's another necklace. Yeah, this is another necklace. And this one I'm definitely probably going to gift because I will not wear this. I really like this one. It's just a shame that it's a little tight on me. So anyways, this is pretty, they feel like really nice material. I'm just not interested personally. So the rest better be freaking makeup. Okay. <sighs> I'm really nervous, you guys. Okay, I'm really excited. So this is a palette, really excited. And oh my gosh, oh my gosh. If this is what I think it is, I'm gonna be so excited because I actually kind of considered picking this up. So let me unwrap it. They have everything really nicely wrapped in here. So this is, oops, <laughs> the sleeve. This is the Odin's Eye in Betty Jean. This is the Planet Spirit Palette. Yes, oh my gosh, yes. This one is so stunning. I remember, that this came out when Lauren May Beauty came out with her palette, but I picked up the Lauren May Beauty palette and this one is absolutely stunning. Look at those beautiful, beautiful shades. So I am really happy with this one because I think this is seriously like the most perfect spring palette. So I'm really excited about that. Oh my gosh, I keep dropping stuff. And then here's what the packaging looks like. It looks really beautiful. So yes, really excited about that. Yes, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is the Stone and Rock palette. Oh my gosh, if I remember correctly, I really hope that this is the one, cause I know that two, I mean, I'm gonna be happy regardless. I feel like this is the more green one. I could be wrong. 
I'm hoping it's the more neutral one. I know that they came out with, in this collection, they came out with two palettes, one that's more green, and then one that's more um, neutral. Please let it be the neutral one. Okay, it's not, but that's okay. This is still super beautiful. Um, so this is the Stone and Rock palette. And I mean, I have to admit that is the most beautiful green color story. So that is really, really pretty. And it comes with a mirror. It's beautiful, beautiful packaging. So yes, really happy with that. So far, so good. And then I think we're down to just one more palette. Ooh. Okay, you guys. <laughs> so excited this is such a good box you guys this is the hella palette so this is odin's eye and angelica neek vest i do not really follow her i know exactly who she is um but i never really watch her stuff i i think she's really talented i really um enjoy like the color stories that she's come up with but I just can't really get into like some of the content that she posts. So that's the only reason why like I'm not like, I guess a, a super follower of her, but this is the Hella palette and it looks very beautiful, the packaging. And I wanna say this is, yes, this is, oh, this is beautiful, you guys. And I was honestly kind of hoping that I would get like more of like, like one of the Angie collaborations because I feel like she did such a good job. So up close here is what this uh, palette looks like. Okay, so I think that is everything. Yeah, that is everything. So let's recap what I got. So this necklace, which I could kind of do without, I think it is really beautiful, but it's a little tight on me because I have such a big neck, but here we are. Um, and then I got this necklace, which is really pretty. And honestly, I might give it to my niece. I think that she will really like this. Then I got, which I was so happy about and seeing it in person, it's absolutely stunning. These, the Planet Spirit palette, really beautiful. Like so, so pleased with that one. Then I got the Stone and Rock palette, which looks absolutely beautiful i kind of wish this one was the more like neutral leaning one but that's okay and then i got the hella palette which is in collaboration with angelica nikvist really beautiful so i am really really happy with the box i want to say that these because i think i got the box that was 75 dollars. i want to say it was the box that was $75 and I want to say that these palettes run anywhere between like $40, $48 and then I think the Stone and Rock palette was like $35 maybe. So that alone already. We're looking at what I paid for and then this palette I think was like $42 something like that. Let me see if they have the totals on the website. Give me one second. Okay, so the Stone and Rock palette is $35.90, so I was about right on that one, and it was the Jewels and Gem palette. That's the one I was really hoping to get. The Planet Spirit palette was $33.90, okay. And then how much is the Hella palette? So by the way, the necklace is $25.90. So this is called the Rock Legend Heart Black Nacre Necklace. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing that. The Pearl Necklace is the Jewel Story Pink Heart Embellished Pearl Necklace. That one is $32. But again, I could have really gone without the jewelry if I'm being honest. I was really hoping to get the Christmas Eve palette, but that's okay. That one is sold out. I'm kicking myself for not picking that up whenever they re-released it this last holiday season, but that's okay. Um, I'm trying to see how much the Hella palette was. I don't think it's on here anymore. Oh wait, here it is. The Hella palette was $43.90. Okay, so the total of my box was $172.50. So 
that is definitely more than what I paid. I want to say I paid, um, like $75, maybe $80. I don't remember. I want to say the box was $75, but then I was able to use discount codes. So still, I mean, a really good deal. And I don't hate the jewelry. I really don't. This feels like really nice quality. It feels like nice enough that I can still, like I said, gift this. And this necklace, I really like but it is a little tight on me, so we'll see, I don't know. But I am so happy, you guys, with the three palettes that I got. I honestly was really worried that I was gonna be getting just, you know, some of their older palettes that maybe they were wanting to get out of their collection, get out of their inventory. I was afraid I was gonna be getting like some OG Odin's Eye. Um, palettes like the Norns and the Alva, things like that. And I wasn't really interested in those, but these are definitely palettes that I have been like interested in that I'm really happy to receive. So anyways, my lesson here is I think in the future I'm gonna partake in the mystery box from Odin's Eye. I really enjoyed this. I think that they included some great products and my advice would be go for the one that's more expensive. I know, I know, I know, I know that it's gonna cost more money up front, but you see how much value this box had and there's only really one product if I think about that I'm not happy with, which is the pearl necklace and it's not that it's not gonna get used. Like I'm literally gonna give this to my niece who I think will look absolutely adorable in that so anyways if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up also i would love for you to subscribe and be a part of my youtube channel family here thank you all so so much for watching and i will go ahead and see you in my next video bye